Good morning. It's just after 10 o'clock. I've been up since 7.30. I have collected garbage like I was planning on. So if, yep, yeah, and I drank that. Um, during the shelf video yesterday, you would have seen the stockpile of garbage that I need to take out. And I didn't mention it because, well, I was dealing with it, so it didn't matter. Um, so that's been done. Um, I've started to pack up a few things. My Bible bag is just about done. I'm not going to end up reading the Bible today. Uh, I'm not going to end up doing a workout today. I still have to pack stuff up. I still want to have a quick lunch before I head out. Um, I still have to head out. Um, I made a list. Do do do. Showers on the list. Take out garbage just when I go shopping. I'd like to get some dishes done, but I don't think it's going to happen. Um, pack. And bring out a couple things to say bye-bye to. -bye. So if I have time, I will do dishes, and you'll be updated on that. But I don't think it's going to get done again today. Next week. Next week. I'm putting it on myself, and I expect you to put it on me too. Next week, next Monday, when I'm back, I'm getting back into this. Because I also can't live this way. I want to be able to do my stuff and I can't do my stuff if my house is in my way so and I have not moved the shelf over there I'm gonna try but I can't guarantee so we shall see we shall see yeah YouTube's on of course <laughs> um, but uh, I, I it's the last one on the on the queue I'm finishing it off. There's probably like 10, 15 minutes left. And I'm going to go and do something. Because I need to get started. So We shall do that shortly. And I will update you as the day goes on. Talk to you later. So I'm kind of sorting through my clothes. And everything has wet spots. Shouldn't. Especially since it was hot in my room last night and I kept having to kick off the blanket. But for whatever reason, they're still wet. So this is going to be interesting. Quite some interesting. Yet another thing I'll have to figure out. Probably end up just bringing it to my mom's house wet and just hanging it up to dry there. Maybe my only choice. But I'll figure it out. At least I have some clean clothes for today. <laughs> ah, there's always a plus side to absolutely everything but at least it's clean gotta give it that I did it and it's clean so I am going to re-figure out how to put everything on my my drying rack to see if it will help it dry within the next couple hours because I still have a couple hours so we'll see Holy poopsicles, it's 11.25 already. <laughs> the day's just going away. By golly, I should have gotten up before. <laughs> um, I, I need to get some stuff done. <laughs> Otherwise, I ain't ever going to get out of here and I'm not going to be ready for three. Oh, buddy. Talk to you soon. Hello again. I'm all showered. I'm going to finish off the cards and the letter, get that going. Brush, well, what now looks like a mop. Um, teeth, deodorant, the whole bit. And then I'm going to head out. It is currently, Alexa, what time is it? It's 1.22 p.m. So I, I have like an hour and a half. I'm budgeting myself an hour and a half um, just because of the fact that I want to be back here by three so that it gives me a little time to finish up the packing. My dad's not supposed to get off work until about 3.34. So let's hope he's not early <laughs> and we'll go from there. But I'm hoping to be back here before three. I'm trying to budget more, like try to push myself closer to the hour just to just so I have the extra time. But I can't do that if I keep talking to you. <laughs> Though I love to. Um, but I do have to get this done. And I do have to bring it in. So I will talk to you in a bit. Yes, I talk with my hands. I'm French. Francaise. Je parle avec mes mains. Je toujours Francaise. I'll talk to you later. It's time to head out. 
it's uh, supposed to be 14 degrees feel like 12 celsius so i will do like last time and put the little fahrenheit at the bottom somewhere around here ish and uh so i'm only wearing a little a little shrug today i'm taking out my trash and i'm gonna pick a couple things from that box to go down well to go at that end of the hallway see you soon I have a donkey sock. I'm home. I'm winded, but I have great news. I'll tell you when I get in. I'm in. And like I said, I'm winded. I was in the elevator. I feel great. <laughs> yes, I'm squeezing through. I feel great. It's been a long time since I've been able to go out and even do a mini shop. And on top of that, ever since I've moved in here, I've had trouble coming up the driveway. It is a long driveway and it is also an uphill driveway. Um, and the sidewalk, for the most part, follows the, um, the driveway on an incline, but the odd time there's steps up. I, I can't do those steps. They hurt my knees. I have such the wicked time coming up once I get past those, I'm trying to get from, and this is where things start to level off. I have such a hard time making it till I can get into my apartment. It's not even funny. Hope he, you guys, those workouts. Oh my gosh. Here I thought, mm. yeah, of course it's building muscle, but at the same time, it's hurting me. I made it up, no problems. I took the stairs, people. I took the stairs. I went up the sidewalk, up the stairs, up the driveway. If you'd see it, you'd be like, holy kick, you've, you, you have a hard time doing it on a good day. Here you did do it. I am so flipping beyond happy right now. It's not even funny. Give me two seconds. I gotta hurry up and do this haul. It is currently 2.49. Like I said, I want to be ready for three. My dad could be calling anytime. So I want to get through this haul because some of this is coming with me. And I want to tell you more things that I did. Okay. So first thing I did, obviously I walked there. I walked into shoppers, went to the back, got my prescription. 63 cents. Believe it or not, even though I have the patient assist card, and this is supposed to be free, it costs 63 cents for a three month supply. I don't know, I don't get it, it is what it is. So, I got that. I also asked the question. My doctor had said that uh, he, she would like to put me on weight loss pills to help with the weight loss. But she said they were expensive, but didn't tell me how much. She didn't really know either off the top of her head, but it is what it is. I was there. I asked the question. Of course, there's generic, there's name brand, and they those also vary in prices. So I was just looking for a ballpark. So he gave me a ballpark. So obviously, whatever one they um, recommend or prescribe could be less, could be more, more than likely around, if not more. That's my guess. But this was a popular one that doctors tend to recommend. $170 a month. So I'm going to have to sit down and see if I can even do it. If it's something that I can budget out and do it done, that's it, I'm good to go. Then I will turn around and talk to my doctor and see what my options are. See if that's the one. Maybe there's one that's a little bit cheaper that I could go on. We'll discuss it at the time. So while I was there, I went to the pharmacy. Everything's mailed off. I even bought craft envelopes for next time. So there's another five in here. So five more letters can be sent out with cards with the whole bit done. But, okay, it cost me $2.49 for those, $1.07 for a stamp, $1.95 for, $1.94 for, I, I think it's to ship that one out the letter and the card 
this was nine dollars and twenty cents and I did pick red since it is my daughter's favorite color it's the color bluff what can you say at least that's what I say so my total there was 1661 then I went to the Bucker 2 plus I spent $42.59. I know. I'm going to follow the receipt and go as it goes. Okay. The first thing on the list is black garbage bags. Sometimes I fill up a couple smaller bags and for me, throw it all in a big bag, pitch it. Then, So that works. So that costs $2.50. The next thing is the LA Totally Awesome Cleaner. In a spray bottle. Now I know I could have gotten this some more cheaper, but it also means being on a bus for like an hour and going to a Dollar Tree. But um, two things that I found that this is supposed to clean. Now I don't know. I will be doing it with you, and if it works, then you will know. One of them is spray paint off a plastic uh, three drawer container that I have. The last person who had it sprayed it, so this is supposed to take it off. Someone else tried it. It worked for them. I'm going to try it in front of the camera so you can see if it works either way. As well as it's supposed to remove tarnish from silver. I have a silver plant pot that's on my table over there that you have seen. I'm going to see if it works for that. It doesn't have to be super shiny. There's a couple other ingredients that I can go back after and get more and make it shinier if it works. Um, the next one is... Tomorrow is my mom's birthday. So this has to be packed up so I can wrap it tonight. So it's just a birthday card. And her favorite color is purple. Uh, get, and that was $2. This was $1.50. There was nothing any purplier. That's my beautiful face. <laughs> so I got this for her. I'm going to put the card in it now, and I'm going to grab that bag as well on my way out the door. So this comes with me, but it's separate. Um, this is also going to my mom's house now that I see it, once I get it out. Because of the fact that uh, it's a glue tape runner. I'm going to be scrapbooking, and you'll be there to watch me do it. It's called Glue Tape Runner. I paid... A dollar fifty for this, or no, two twenty-five for this, and I guess it's four meters long. Um, yeah, so we will be testing this as well later, uh, probably tomorrow. Uh, not tomorrow, so uh, maybe tomorrow night, but Saturday, Friday, Saturday, maybe, and, and if not Sunday, we'll be testing it out. I will test it on camera, and you will know it, it is by the Forever in Time brand. So we will see. Um, so I got myself another charger and this is the proper cable just because I needed the block. Um, but the extra cable doesn't hurt anything. Um, then that way I have it uh, while I am there. And this cost me $6.50. It is a one meter cord. I have a longer one. But again, um, the CM Mobile, I will test it. And we will see if it works great and if there's no reason it shouldn't um, but every once in a while you get that defect uh, so we'll see either way we shall see that's being packed up um, I also because I think it's my extension cord that is going out the window I've had it for uh, just over three years I bought it while I was in shelter just because I needed my um, to plug in my phone but the outlet was too far away for me to put it on on the nightstand I would have had to have it laying on the bed and then with me rolling around all the time it would have just fallen in behind the bed so I had bought it for that um I did get it at a dollar store never had an issue with it but recently um I can hear the electricity pumping through it so that's never a good thing um and the new charger block is heating up so I'm assuming that is the cause but we will see this one is from Extricity, a general household indoor extension cord. And that one I paid $2.70 for. Uh, I can take that with me and test it out. As I said before, 
Bucker 2 Plus is slightly more expensive, but you can still usually get a lot of the same items. Um, I did want to see if I could find one and try it. So I got the Selection Brand ink pad. Now this is a massive ink pad. Like this is the length of my hand. Like it's, it's sizable. It's not like your regular ink pad. However, I can't see it not work. And if you are any kind of crafter, I would hope you know that you should not be storing your ink pads like this because they do dry out faster. Store them upside down. And this one is for me to use at my house. So it'll go on my shelf upside down. I paid $1.65 for that. If it works and it's good, you can bet your bottom dollar I'll be going back for more. Um, I did also get an extra large, because I use extra large, rubber gloves. Now, I, I usually use um, the vinyl, but they didn't have extra large vinyl. It was one size fits all. I've tried those before. I'm not wasting my money on it again. I am a plus size woman. My hands are not fit. They're not sticks. Um, so I have to go larger. I bought these to use with this because I was told it's going to be harsh on my hands. And with the eczema, I'm better off using it. So look, they match. They're both yellow. So those stay here. I paid $1.25 for that. This is the first thing that came up. I bit the bullet. I needed socks. Last time I was at Dollarama, which is where I normally get my socks, they didn't have any of the socks that I like. So, like I said, I bit the bullet. $12.99, but there are 12 socks. For $11.99, I could have gotten 10 socks all white. I like color. So I'll be taking some of those with me. I might just throw the whole thing in because it'll be easier than trying to rip that open right now. Um, and I got a little something for my niece in the future for a little gift. It's just a little notepad with unicorns and she loves her unicorns. I didn't even know how much it was going to cost me and I didn't really care because it's a little something I can throw in and anything in a little card, in a little gift bag, in whatever, $1.35. Perfect. I was hoping to find my crystal light. The uh, coconut pineapple one. It's called Aloha Pineapple Coconut. They did not have it. So I turned around and went to Metro. The only crystal light they had were the ones I already have. For $4.50, you will be getting that clip now. So you'll be getting the clip now. I'm going to stop this video, start a new one because it's easier in editing. So you're going to get the clip now. And so I wasn't going to pay that price, but I did want something with a different flavor. So I got the selection. Something had to go wrong because I'm rushing. Okay, notifications are popping in, but it's not dead. Um, I got the selection brand peach mango. I figured I would try. It's got the same kind of sweetener in it, so I, I should be fine drinking this one as well. And that one cost me. Wrong with see. $2.99 plus tax of $3.38. So that is what I spent today. I spent uh, $42, 52 58 I spent over $60 in less than an hour. But it's still better than $110 I did at my sister's house ordering offline. So that is it. Oh, no, that is not it. You saw me check my mail. And I, um, I, I, I will have to check to see whether or not the address came up on that. I will blur it if it did. Because you shouldn't be seeing my address. I don't know what's come in this month. So this is um, Stamps for Life. It's a monthly subscription that I have through them. I've gotten um, January, February, my gift. This is March. Um, but it actually came in, in in the order of February, gift, and January. Um, every 12 months I get a $15 gift certificate to the store. Um, so that's on your anniversary month. So when you first subscribe, that's when you get it. Works for me because January is my birthday month. I subscribed in January, which means every year I get to treat myself with a birthday gift from them. 
And then there's 15 off in store, and there's a couple other things too, I can't remember. But for the under $16, I pay for these, and my sister says they seem like very good quality. I have not tested any out yet. I will do that this weekend. Um, it is well worth the price. So I guess I got flowers, two layers, stamp set. I, you can get the die set. I did not get the die set. And you can also get scrapbook kit. So you just get a bunch of scrapbook supplies as well. I don't have the budget to be able to bump it up that much, but I do eventually want to get the die sets. But right now, if I like the stamps, I can always get the die set later. So this one, slight angle to stop the glare, as you can see. And I'm very happy with this one because I do like to use the greenery. It says, thinking of you, happy birthday. You mean the world to me, my friend. And then, like I said, there's flowers, there's greeneries. This will get used. So this will be going to my mom's house as well. So. so. That's it. So I am going to go finish packing and take this thing off because I'm a sweating buckets here. <laughs> and I will drink the rest of this just to help cool me off. And I will talk to you later. That's coming too. <laughs> no, I'm not bringing everything in the kitchen sink. I just want a little variety and I want to try it. If I was bringing everything in the kitchen sink, I'd be bringing all my crafting supplies, all my quilting stuff. I would do it, but I'm not. But I will let you go and I will talk to you later on. I'm not sure at this point when I'll be able to vlog next, but I will say goodnight. Uh, at some point but uh, and in the morning I'm not sure exactly how I'm gonna pull that one off um, I am going to my sister's in the morning so I will vlog some there no matter what you are gonna get vlogged you're gonna get good mornings you're gonna get good nights even if I have to do voiceovers I'll figure it out don't worry I will figure it out I will talk to you soon she fits pretty good feels nice and comfy this is only one of the colors I like it now to see uh, how badly my feet sweat in these. <laughs> oh, I'm not going to like the summer for that part. Oh, but I need the support on my feet. And I can't have too thick of socks because then I sweat. That's why even during the winter, I have to wear summer socks. Fun, isn't it? So Dad has called and he's on his way. So it's time to grab my stuff and head down. And like I said, I'll see you next when I see you next. But either way, I'll be seeing you. Well, actually, you'll be seeing me. So we'll talk to you soon. I'm here. I'm on salad and make set the table duty. So I'm going to get to that and we'll talk again later. Salad completed. I was hoping for some dried cranberries, but I can't find them. So this is what it is. Time for fried mushrooms. Look what I found. They were on sale for $3 a piece. Posh pomegranate. Not as good as the other ones, but still good. <laughs>